How does that apple taste? Mm -hmm. Good. Very good. And as you go deeper into this deeper state of trance, a beautiful white entity is going to come forward and it's going to speak to you. And you're going to hear every word it says. It's going to give you a quick message and we're going to come back and get off this table so you can go home and feed your dog. Are you finished with the apple? Mm -hmm. And if you turn around, I believe they should be there. What is this white light? You just see a white light? Mm -hmm. Right. Very good. And ask that bright light, what is its message for you? It has one. Uh, don't give up. Don't do what? Don't give up, keep going. Ah, uh, don't give up, keep going? Yeah. Very good. And is it going to at least let's, what else, where, and is it going to point you in the right direction or lead you in the right direction? There will be many paths. There will be many paths? Yes. Yeah. Very good. Did you, I want you to tell that the reason why you came is you were trying to uh, see the base on the Mars and on, on the moon. How come, ask it, how come you couldn't Since see it that? Because it knows everything. Beg your pardon? Since it knows everything. Oh, it knows everything? Yes. Ah, beautiful. It says in time. In time what? In time all will be known. All will be known? Yes. Well, ask it, what can it share with you right now? Don't give up. Uh, and keep when going. it says, I'm sorry. I keep going. Don't give up and keep going. Yes. In terms of don't give up what? With pushing himself. Ah, uh, with pushing yourself? Yeah. Ah, uh, very good. Mm -hmm. what, what just happened? Nothing. Uh, so it says don't give up and keep pushing yourself. And you get to, are you going to end up with the position in San Francisco then? It doesn't know. It doesn't know? There are many paths. There's many paths. Definitely in California. Yeah, you're definitely going to be in California. Mm -hmm. And ask it, does it have a, a message for Hank then? Just good job. Oh, good job. <laughs> So, is it, uh, how do they feel about us exploring the way we're exploring with this technique? It says that it's, it's indifferent. No, it doesn't. Indifference. Right? Okay, no big deal? Yeah. Oh, okay. And so all will be known in time. Okay, very good. And what have I been doing a good job at? Mommy. Helping. Loving and helping? Yes. Oh, very good. Tell him I said thank you very much. Mm -hmm. What just happened then? I was telling them. Say it again? I was telling them. Oh, okay. Very good. And uh, since we've come all this way, uh, is there anything else besides don't give up? We're we're, all, we're trying to search out for some information. Can they give us anything whatsoever? We're sharing this message with the entire world. What message do they have for the world? In time, the truth will be known. In, when, in time. Oh, very good. And what truth is are there? What particular truth is the light speaking of? The truth of humanity. Ah, uh, the truth of humanity. And what is the truth of humanity? The interconnectedness will be known. Ah, oh, the interconnectedness. Very good. You know, there there's a probability a lot of people will see this video and because uh, is uh, what else? Anything else? Anything else that anyone who happens to hear this would be able to handle? To continue to love. Continue to love. And release pain. And to release pain. Hurt. And hurt.
very good. The planet will make it through this ascension process, will it not? There's no choice involved. There's no choice involved, okay. It's divine will? It is done. It is? It is already done. Oh, it's already done. It's already time done. Is, time is, time is everything. Time is everything? And everything. And everything is time. So it's done, but we have yet to experience it. Yes. Though. We have yet to experience it. So it's already happened, but it, we have yet to experience it. Yes. Understood. Is there anything uh, that we could look forward to in our near future? Harmony. Beautiful. Beautiful, beautiful. So uh, Rico's doing a beautiful, a good job as well, yes? Yes, he's trying. Very good. We were trying to, uh, well, you know what we were doing, right? When we went to the yes. Mars, right? Yes. And you know what we were doing on the moon as well? Yes. Why didn't, why wouldn't they show you anything? So in time. Okay. So we had we were watching a video with uh, David Wilcock and Corey Good, and they were able to pull out all that information. Is it not best for us to pull out that information as well? When the time is right, we're saying. Okay, but well, David was saying that the information needed to get out there as much as possible uh, to help with what's going on on the planet. Is that only for him and not for everyone else? The planet, it will be known to the planet eventually. The word will communicate. So it's not our position to spread that message at all then? The message is already out. Oh, very good. It's slowly spreading. Well, we can go by faith. The reason why uh, I had a desire for Rico to, because uh, he worked, can I say where you worked before? It was already. Oh, okay. Well, you know where Rico worked before, and so that's why we thought it would be nice. Can you just at least tell him, is there a base on the moon then? There is presence there. There are presents there. And what about on the Mars as well? There's presents everywhere. I know. Are there any human beings from Earth there, though? At times. And they're coming from the Earth in this linear time frame? Potentially, but not. Yes, potentially. And who are the. More eight? so in the future. More so in the future. You mean much more in the future, is that correct? Yes. So can, may we ask, who are the avians? The avian, the blue avian? Protectors. Protectors. Yeah. Are they the ones who showed up at Hank's house in the, uh, with the blue orbs? Yes. They are for sure? Yes. And what is Hank's connection with the blue avian? From where Hank came from, they may have known each other. Ah, very good. So is Hank uh, one of the Blue Avian then? No. No? He's a friend. Or... A friend? Yes. And what about Rico? Is he connected with them at all? No. He's human. He's human. And Hank is not human, is he? Hank is evolved. Evolved. Very good. And those Blue Avian. Um, what, why were, they were, why did they come to Hank's house and he was able to video them? What was that all about? They just come to watch over him once in a while. Oh, they're watching over me? Yes. Very good. Are they protecting me? Yes, but he doesn't need it. Hank doesn't need protection? No. He why? He's very good at doing it himself. He 
already can do it himself. Yeah. What? But they just come because they friend a friend. They want to make sure. Ah, they came to because we were friends. Mm hmm What? What is? What is having significance on the planet? To help people learn to grow. Where is he originally from? Somewhere far away. And how does he know? How is he connected with all these extraterrestrials? Everyone is connected. Oh, very good. But you just said Rico was a human and Hank was something else. Some people are more no more than others as far as how they're connected, how well they're connected. And I, you say I'm connected with those blue avians then? Yes. And what about the Aeon as well? Not as much. Am I connected with the Aeon? A little bit, yes. Okay. So I'm connected with the Aeon and the avians. What about the Draconians? Is he connected with the Draconians in any way? Not so much. Not so much. Very good. Is there anything else that you can share with Hank in this moment? To continue the path. Continue on the path. Very good. And what about for Rico as well? To don't give up and persevere. One more time, clearly. Do not give up. Change will happen. Uh, do not give up and change will happen. Very good. We like to explore. Um, is there a reason why Rico is not able to see anyone or speak to anyone? The timing. The timing. The uh, timing. The timing isn't proper. Yeah. Very good. Well, we apologize for him just yet. Okay. Well, we apologize and we're thankful that you know keeping everything within, you know, his contract. Are there contracts that we make before we come to this planet? Yes, but they can be modified slightly. Okay. Have we modified it by making these trips here as such? No. So this was meant then? We could all have to have an intent, personal intention to change it. Ah, oh, very good. <laughs>